morning lovely people apologies about the shake <laughs> in the video he's not sat here with me no <laughs> so oh, I'll cut that I'll cut that <laughs> uh, I'm gonna keep it in you made me laugh <laughs> oh man Sorry, right, excuse the mess. I, uh, it's Saturday morning. I was supposed to be riding to the, get out of the way, pigeon. I was supposed to be riding to the post office and then to the start this morning. But although I don't look unwell, I haven't. <laughs> I haven't been that well this morning. So I am on my way. I haven't got a clue what time it is because obviously um, my car was put in See, rambling. You'd think I'd have a script. It's about time I had a script. So then I could talk to you all properly. So I had the car go in yesterday. Um, the car went in yesterday. It went in for the flywheel. Bloody 1,200 quid. 1,240. Two pounds and 20 something P. What the bloody hell did the 20 something P come from in all that amount of money? <laughs> anyway. Anyway, so actually this is showing it's 1958 at the moment. So I have no idea what's what, right? So it's around 8 to 8.30, I would say, if, if I could. I don't have got a watch on. I'm actually driving um, to the post office because I don't want to wait for the item until Tuesday now. Um, but I was going to ride there this morning and put a few miles on the clock. Um, on the bike because I'm still testing Ruby out. She, she rode really well yesterday um, But as you know the noise the, I think last time the noise started about just under a hundred miles in so um, So I was just gonna try and get as many miles as I can again apologies about the, the shake because of the uh, I'm on the mobile um, at the moment so I got a uh, flab ride this morning. Um, it looks glorious out there. It looks glorious. And if anybody's watching this and went out this morning three or four times going, what the bloody hell am I gonna wear? Because th there's a good chance that when that sun breaks through later, that it might actually warm up. But it's still only saying um, 11 degrees tops. Um, yeah and it just need that four you know four fifth up to 15 and, and it's shorts and a and a thinner top you know with maybe short sleeves weather isn't it because the, the sun is bloody warm so nobody knows what they're going to be wearing today i've actually got long bibs out because it's freezing this morning it was bloody two degrees when i went out there at seven o'clock to check the bike um but yes um so hopefully hopefully you've all had a an enjoyable weekend i'll probably make this a weekend vlog um so hopefully get this out to you um monday but then that may all change i may cut that bit out and, and get it out to you later on today um had a bit of an issue with one of my vlogs that has probably disappeared you, you, some of you might not have even noticed it but um, ended up deleting a vlog. I may re-edit some of it and then um, repost it. Uh, again, that'll be done later. Um, again, I'll explain the uh, details in there. Me being a noob, just a noob as usual. Um, but yes, so great stuff. So I'm on my way to the post office to pick something up to sign for it. It's a couple of cyclists out already and they look like they are wrapped up nice and warm. Um, so yes, it's, uh, and I'm off work now for a week, for a whole week. Next Saturday, actually, I've got my first aid course, so that'd be cool. Um, yeah, so anyway, just thought I'd catch up with you this morning. I'll probably won't have time when I get home. I'll be running around getting ready because I'm running late and I'm feeling a bit better just in case you were concerned. If you wasn't, then don't worry. I'm okay. So, great stuff. I will obviously see you out on the road later on today.
Boring at the front. Wonderful views. What a beautiful view. Welcome, the and the new <laughs> to Tiago. Oh, look, that was I supposed to get that riding shot with with Alan in the way. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. There's the entry shot, and cut. <laughs> if that's as bad as it gets today. Then
Hi guys. Uh, flab ride over and done with. I've done 28.9, probably gonna do about 30 miles when I get home. Battery's gonna die on this baby, so um, I was gonna do a few more miles. My knees have been giving me a bit of jip. My left knee has been giving me a bit of jip. Um, I crumble down the stairs the other evening. Um, but yeah, so it was a nice ride, bloody cold as you can see. Got my leg warmers on and my wind jacket because it is cold and the wind picked up mahusibly. So lovely people, how are we? Um, as you can see, that abrupt cut was nothing to do with my editing skills, all right? That was actually the GoPro completely dying on me. And I was at the top of Danes Hill, so I had to go right for a mile or go left for another six miles. So ended up going left, I don't know why, I was going to go home, but ended up putting another six miles on. So I did just over 35 miles in the end which was cool, which was more than I was going to do. My knees have been giving me some jip as I kind of tried to sort of um, mention. <laughs> uh, yeah, um, as some of you know, the AC, I snapped my ACL in my right knee and had an accident in 2015, which completely... Um, bugging my knee up um, but the meniscus issues I've got in the left knee now are due to um, the recovery of the when I did my ACL in my right knee so um, I remember being out walking as soon as I could I needed to get back to work basically so uh, yeah so I ended up damaging my um, left knee trying to recover the right knee um, which is a pain. And um, when I went to see the doctor, he said, go and lose some weight. Thanks. Thanks, mate. Chap. Obviously, I'm a middle-aged where they can't be bothered to operate anymore. That's uh, not going to whinge. Not going to whinge. Not going to whinge. Um, so I manage it. I used to play um, golf a lot. But I haven't played since March. Um, yeah, finished about March last year. So... Uh, but anyway, so I've been out on the bike. So I ride when I can, where I can, how far I can, and just try and uh, sometimes if I want to ride um, consecutive days, sometimes I just gotta be careful. So uh, yeah, so 35 miles a day, 20 miles tomorrow, got probably 20, 30 miles tomorrow. I know we're doing probably about 25 to 30 miles on Monday. So, you know, it all adds up at the end of the day. So it's cool. So finished the flab ride today, it was excellent. Um, it was um, very cold, even though, I have to show you, it looks absolutely gorgeous out there. You know, let me just try and dink, there you go. It looks absolutely gorgeous in the garden. In fact, you've just missed the fact that it just rained and the top of the sun lounge was completely soaked and I just got in. Ooh, so dark. <laughs> Here I am. Yeah, uh, so actually gorgeous out there, but it is bloody cold. But the wind turned up for no reason. Um, but yeah, it's cool. We stopped off at <coughs> together, as you could see in the video. And uh, yeah, um, fantastic coffee. Uh, fantastic coffee. The bacon and the sausage rolls were pants. I'm sorry, but um, I saw someone with, with the bacon last uh, last week and it was just one piece of bacon and a bit of roll. And uh, yeah, you know, nice bit of salad to go with it, you know, bit modern. But, um, and somebody, walked, they, one of the waitresses walked past this morning with a sausage bap and I thought well you know there's a couple of sausages in there cut in half excellent no mine turned up with only one sausage cut in half so it's a pity because the coffee is gorgeous the coffee is really really nice we go this way actually because then you can see my gorgeous young face so it's you know it's a bit of criticism on their part I'm afraid and you can see my haircut <laughs> see my highlights do you see my highlights grey by choice 
So yes, um, I'm not slating them because we will go back because the, obviously they do homemade everything on the cake sides homemade, so it's really good. And to be fair, the the um, breakfast awesome. They looked awesome. I know people were there was um, somebody that had a poached egg on Belgian waffles that looked awesome. So yeah, don't you know when you're on your bike you want to just go and have something quick but something substantially quick and uh yeah it's a, it's a bit of criticism but the the you know don't tea and coffees the pot chocolate everything else probably cool and we will go there and sample the breakfast i'll take the family down there and sample the breakfast but if you're looking for a bacon or sausage sandwich um probably not it's the second time um as i said i think they've run out of sausages and they should have just said they'd run out of sausages and I'd have probably had something else, but anyway. Anyway, is what it is. Um, but as I said, um, coffee's great, tea's great, and the breakfasts look bloody lovely. So get yourself down there and check them out for definite. Um, yes, so I've got beginner ride uh, tomorrow, Sunday. Um, got a couple of newbies, and hopefully uh, that'd be cool. Hopefully that'd be a, a nice little day. And as I said, hopefully 20, 30 miles out of that. It's a 10-mile ride for the Flat Beginner Ride. Um, yeah, and hopefully I'll uh, see you then. Music